Welcome back in this lecture we are going to see how to insert a single and multiple documents into the collection but before doing that let's see how to create a database and how to start inserting into a fresh collection so let's assume we have some movies data so i'm going to create a database called as movies db database so for that i'm saying use movies db so far i don't have any such database but when i said use movies db it has switched to a database named as movies db but if i say show db you still don't see this movies db in, in here because until and unless i don't create a single collection into it it will not appear in the databases so let me try to create a collection for that i have to say db dot collection name so let's assume my collection name is movies and inside that i'm going to insert a single document for now for that i have to use the insert one operation and then the document that i wanted to insert so here i have inserted a document that has a id the name of the movies the year in it in which it was published its genre its rating its description so this is how i can insert a single document into my movies collection so let me run it now so here you got the acknowledged message and saw that it has been inserted so if i say show dbs again now you will start seeing that movies db inside your dbs list okay and if i say db dot movies dot find pretty operation so it will start showing the document that we just inserted right now so if you wanted to clear the screen just use the control l command so let me insert multiple documents into the same collection so insert one command was to insert a single document but if you wanted to insert multiple document so you have to use insert menu operation and inside that you have to pass the list of all the documents that you wanted to insert as i told you that the json documents start with this curly braces and ends with this curly braces so this represent my one document that is my one movie and then this second one represent my second document that represent a second movie and so on let's say i wanted to insert all these movies details so i have to say db dot movies dot insert many and after that you have to use this square bracket and then you have to copy paste all the documents that are in the json format separated by comma after this close this with square bracket and then round bracket and let me press enter now so you will get this acknowledged message here and the inserted ids as well so if i just run the find pretty method operation here again so i will get all the documents that i inserted just now using the insert menu operation so there is one more important thing that i wanted to tell you so notice here in my movies collection i am going to insert one more document so here my document contains of name year genre rating and description so let me run this now here you will see something called as inserted id that is the object id given to each and every document mongodb internally provides a object id to each and every document so here you can see this inserted id this object id uniquely identify this particular document in my mongodb cluster so if i go and print my all documents in this collection so here in the last you can see my document has been added and a new underscore id has been associated with this document so there are two ways either you can provide your own ids and if you are not providing mongodb will create a unique identifier for your document so that is all for this lecture we saw how to insert a single document and multiple documents into a collection so stay tuned let me see you in the next lecture